This video shows you how to inform patients at the start of the treatment and how to care for patients during treatment. The benefit for the patient will be better results of the treatment. Every time a patient comes to take their drugs, ask them how they are feeling. Have there been any changes since the last visit? The main problems you may find are side effects of the drugs, signs of new nerve damage or inflammation, new social problems related to leprosy. Serious side effects of leprosy treatment are rare. The most serious side effects are a serious allergy to one of the drugs, jaundice. If either of these happens, you must stop the treatment and send the patient to a medical officer. The patient may have other, less serious side effects. But when this happens, it is important to continue the treatment. Explain that it is normal to have some side effects, but they are not serious and will go away when the treatment is finished. These less serious side effects are Rifampicin turns the urine red Clofazimine can change the color of the skin. Dapsone sometimes causes black spots on the skin. These may itch but they are not dangerous. It is an important monthly routine to check on signs of new nerve damage or inflammation. With its early detection, disabilities can be prevented. Check for any signs of leprosy reactions. Reactions can happen before, during and after treatment. They are not a side effect of the drugs and the patient must continue MDT along with the treatment for a reaction. Record your findings. This helps you to better detect changes in nerve function and to act without delay. MDT can safely be given during pregnancy. What to do when a patient has completed treatment? When the patient has taken 6 months of treatment for PB leprosy or 12 months for MB leprosy, it is a perfect occasion to congratulate him or her. A final examination should exclude yet undetected nerve damage and skin lesions. This is important should the patient ever return with complications like a reaction or relapse. As usual, findings are recorded on the patient card. Patients who have finished the treatment are cured. The leprosy bacilli have been killed. However, some signs of leprosy may remain. For example, skin patches caused by the leprosy will not disappear immediately. For some people, light colored patches remain on the skin permanently. You must explain this to patients who have patches of this kind or they may not understand why the treatment has been ended. Explain the browning of skin due to clofazamine that disappears in a matter of months. Loss of feeling, muscle weakness and other nerve damage may also remain. This is very understandable and we should take every effort to share this with the patient. Patient may as well ask for continuation of MDT or other and better drugs. As you have no better drugs to offer, he may try to get them somewhere else. Similarly, leprosy patients that have been released from treatment somewhere else may report to you for treatment. As they will not inform you about their MDT, they can easily be mistaken for new cases and put on MDT. Whenever possible, this should be prevented. You must make sure that your patient knows how to best prevent more damage in future. The problem that happens most often after treatment is new nerve damage caused by reaction. If this happens, you do not need to restart the leprosy treatment, but you must treat the reaction. When you see the patient at the end of the treatment, explain that they should come back immediately if any of the previous symptoms come back again. For now, however, it is time to congratulate the patient with the completion of MDT and to ensure that he or she feels welcome to return for any reason. 
multi drug treatment follow up always remember while on mdt be alert to detect serious side effects of drugs such as jaundice or drug allergy stop the mdt and refer the case mild side effects are rifampicin turns the urine red and clofazamine can change the color of the skin detect signs of leprosy reactions that is inflamed patches or enl continue mdt and treat reactions at completion of treatment congratulate the patient and explain the care to be taken after cure that is self care and when to report again